Hello YouTubers, today we're going to be talking about a skin graft. Um, in July 2018 I had a, an accident and a, it was a robbery and so they came over to me and they um, asked me for my car key and my wallet and all that stuff. So I refused to give it to them so they shot me <laughs> right on the chest. The bullet went all the way down to the stomach pancreas and lost a kidney so they did a big operation so they had to get some of my skin from right here from my leg this is what they call a skin graft this is already happening a year ago so that happened in July 2018 and we already a year 2019 July 2019 and look at the way it's, it, it's healing it healed well, you hear me? First, it looked nasty, all bruised up. Uh, some of the area over here look uh, part of circulation, I don't know, but it fading out the same. Um, in the beginning, it was like this, but it started fading out like this. Um, the skin is started getting some color. Um, so they remove some of that part and they replace it. They put it right on my stomach. So the way it is looking like my other leg, this is the other leg, how they look. Now I look healthy, not too healthy, I was a little better, but I had to learn how to walk and all this stuff because um, I spent almost six months in the hospital. Okay, so next is, we got the stomach right here. This is why they did the skin graft and they place it in this. I wear this belt. So this is my stomach right here. The area where they had to open this to do all their operation. The reason that they told me that they had to do this is because I got too many operation. I was open for too long. And also I got a back infection. So they had to remove some of the skin and all that stuff. Um, When I was in the hospital, they were doing all the cleanup and other stuff. When they released me from the hospital, I have a company who were coming over here and cleaning. It was cleaning every other day. They was cleaning and coming and doing all the cleaning and make sure there's no infection. And also I had a tube right in the back here for, they were doing the drain for all, everything. So this is the way it looked now. This, this is the skin that came from my leg. Um, right now it's look kind of weird and nasty, but, um, hoping by the end of September, they're going to make sure the skin is soft again. They have to be soft. Um, they have to be released, able to lift it. That way they can remove the skin draft and they're going to close it down. So... Basically, I'm going to get my stomach, um, my belly button, I don't have it anymore, but they're going to rebuild it back again. This is the call a skin graft. If you guys have, uh, if you burn or you had a back infection in your leg on part of your body, this is what the hospital do, the skin graft like this. Um, recovery, it's take a while, but you have to take care, okay? So, they're going to look good, I hope. It's gonna work out, show you guys how it is. Um, I didn't have no complication, except my other part, my pancreas, part of my stomach, and I don't have a kidney, so those are the problems that I have, but medication, eating healthy, and have people who can uh, take care of you, you know, tell you what to do. Uh, so far, can do no lifting right now because I'm using a belt. This is for protection. For protection, um, this belt worked pretty good so far. Um, I think this is the third one that I have, but it worked okay. Um, so a skin graft, they remove it from the leg from here and replace it. Put it over here. Okay. So I hope this uh, help you guys. See you next. For your next comment, let me know. Send me there, I can help you. Bye bye. Thank you for following me on YouTube and give me a 
Thanks a lot. Bye.